Hey everyone, I wanted to answer a very common question I get, which is people's objection to Bitcoin being that it will get outcompeted by some other technology that comes down the pike. Number one, which is super important, is its anonymous creation. It is extremely important that the technology was created by someone that we don't know who they are. Nobody wants to invest their hard-earned money in a technology where someone somewhere controls it and might change the rules on you. So that is no longer the case. That is the reason people are willing to trust it with $2 trillion of value right now. The reason people are willing to do that, the reason I'm willing to have 97% of my liquid net worth in Bitcoin, and the reason it's held in huge quantities by a huge number of people, is because we know that there is no single building, there is no single individual, there is nobody that can hijack Bitcoin because it's so decentralized, meaning there's basically, you know, it's, it's like an organism with no head. <laughs> so because there's no head, there's nothing that can go wrong because somebody, you know, pushes the wrong button or makes the wrong decision because it's completely decentralized. Bitcoin has 97% it's actually, I think, up to 99%, somewhere between 97% and 99% of all of the computing power that is securing and auditing all of the cryptocurrencies in the entire world, all 20,000 of them, somewhere between 97% and 99% of that security and auditing is happening on a single cryptocurrency, just one, and that is Bitcoin. So the only reason Bitcoin could have an anonymous creation, meaning nobody knows who Satoshi Nakamoto is, the only reason that was even possible is because it was the very first cryptocurrency and nobody was paying attention. So back in 2009, 2010, and part of 2011, before Satoshi Nakamoto signed off, before he gifted it to the world and disappeared, nobody was paying attention. <laughs> nobody, you know, very few people were, re were even following Bitcoin. It barely had an even, you know, observable price. And so there was just no reason for people to try to figure out who he was because it was such an irrelevantly small project. That is no longer the case. Cryptocurrency is a known thing. So anybody new that tries to create any new form of monetary instrument at all is not going to have the benefit of being able to stay anonymous. So um, anyway, it's essentially a once in a, you know, once in a, you know, human history sort of opportunity to create something like that where nobody's paying attention. You can do it under the radar. You can work out all the bugs. You can gift it to humanity and then you can move on without anyone ever finding out who you are. That would be nearly impossible for any other technology to replicate. And if you don't have that, you also don't have the second item, which is decentralization. It is absolutely vital that nobody is in charge of Bitcoin, that there is no single individual or company that is behind it.